If the DB11 was a step towards Aston Martin's destiny, well this right here, it's a leap. Washington DC's Aston Martin is having an exclusive event in just a bit with this car, but we're auto mentality, so of course we get to show you first. Welcome to the future of Aston Martin. Meet the new Vantage. So I've always wanted to be a Bond girl. And standing next to this car, probably the closest I'm gonna get, because as you can see, the design draws from James Bond's DB10. It's beautiful. And aggressive. The sleek exterior is meant to be both graceful and functional. The front splitter channels airflow beneath the car and there, cool air is directed wherever it's needed. The side gills behind the front wheels allow air pressure to escape. And along with the sweep at the rear of the vehicle, they contribute significant downforce. Under the hood, we find a four liter twin turbo V8 making 503 horsepower. You know what they say, you want a fast girl, you need a fast car. Well, according to Aston Martin, the Vantage will hit 60 miles per hour in just 3.5 seconds, reaching a top speed of 195 miles per hour. Let's talk about the shoes. Taking the Vantage to that top speed are 20 inch wheels wearing specially designed Pirelli P0 tires. Ooh, oh, so comfortable in here. You can tell it's different. We're on to the new school because it's totally different than the previous generation Vantage and an upgrade from the DB11 as well. I love this carbon fiber detail. The leather is, it smells good, it's soft, it's warm, it's inviting, and it's comfortable. I mean, it looks small from the outside, but I'm pretty tall and I have room to move my legs and do all of that. I mean, it is a sports car, so I'm sitting low, but I still have plenty of space right here. You can also access the various suspension settings right on the steering wheel. Like, how convenient is that? The different drive modes feature Sport, Sport Plus, and Track. Paddle shifters behind the wheel are substantial, so if you're one of those people that think you might miss a crucial gear shift, don't even worry about it. The central glass buttons are beautiful, with switches above to control airflow. Overhead sits a navigation screen that's much easier than the last generation to both see and use. I think we all agree, the interior is amazing, but the moment you've been waiting for, how does the Vantage sound? Well, they did it again. Aston Martin is continuing their streak of making cars that are both beautiful to drive and to own. And if it meets the capabilities that they've been teasing in the recent videos, well, it's gonna be a resounding success. And if you're the Aston faithful, prepare to be amazed because this is the sports car we've all been waiting for.